Hey, what's up guys? Ashley here. So I am getting ready to send out my emails for my pumpkin spice launch. Um, I am getting ready to set up my Google Street pipeline for my pumpkin spice launch. So I just wanted to do a quick little tutorial and show you guys what that looks like um, in my Gmail inbox and, um, and how I'm getting that started. So um, I'm gonna do a little screen share. So streak is through Gmail. So you have to go to, you can go to streak.com, add to Gmail, download it first. Um, and then you will see when you go into your email, you'll see this like streak thing pipelines over here. So I go in and do the plus sign and that gives you a new pipeline. I always do blank. I feel like that's the most simple. I don't know anything about any of the other ones. I've never used any of the other ones. I just want to keep it as basic for myself as I can. The less complicated, the better. So you create that pipeline and it gives you an automatic default stage. So I'm going to name this stage pumpkin spice interest name. So I want to know who it is. Um, and then you can actually go in and you can click on the, this little settings thing here and you can change your colors and stuff. So like, ooh, let's go with something fall. Okay, so then I'm gonna hit this plus sign over here and I'm gonna add another stage. So name and then I'm going to go with sent info. Um, and you can edit and make these totally your own. Um, so I have a pumpkin spice document. I have, um, I'm not going to include this in the mass email, like the mass email that I send to my customer list, that's not going to be in the sent information. But if they have, um, interest from that email and they're on my customer list, then I'm going to move them into my streak pipeline but not unless they do, because um, I don't want to put, you know, 500 names in sent info. That's just too much, too much, too um, much. So sent info, and then I'm going to go to sent enrollment, or maybe to simplify it, sent order link. And then you just hit enter for each of those. Um, and then I'm going to put ordered. Okay, so I am keeping this as basic as possible. So I did a post on my social media with, um, you know, people that, um, who likes pumpkin spice? Um, that's a great post to do today. Um, it's a great post to do within the next few days um, because it does launch on January 17th. So you just click on this, you highlight, you know, you can click on these to highlight them and then you'll just do a plus sign. So like, Ashley Roberts is interested. Okay, so this is from my Facebook post. So what I'm doing is I'm just going to go in and, or maybe they're interested from Instagram. I did a poll or something and they're interested. So I'm gonna put them in there um, and just keep it simple. Now you can click on this little box over here and you can go in and add their notes. So like Instagram name is Fit Mommy Ashley. So I can save that. Um, I can put, you know, add a comment, clicked on poll once more info. You don't have to do any of those things, but it just helps you in the long run. And then you'll go back. Um, so that information is in there. <clears throat> so say I sent Ashley the information, then I'm just gonna go back where that little thing is and move me into the sent info stage. Okay, I sent her the information. So then she messages me back and she's like, all right, girl, like send me the link, I wanna order this. So this is work that's gonna be done as soon as the BB links comes out. Whenever the BB links comes out and they're, you know, they've, I've sent them the information, I'm going to say, hey, you know, I, I had sent you the information, here's the link to order your um, pumpkin spice, you know, let me know that you've got it um, and have that conversation with them. So I can go back in and click, okay, sent order link. And then, 
you know what? She ordered it on the 17th. Okay, perfect. And then I'm moving her to the ordered stage. So that way this streak keeps track of my people who had been interested, who I had sent information to, who I'd sent the order link to. Say they don't order, but I've ordered, you know, a bunch of packets here. Um, and I decide, you know, in three weeks after say it's sold out in the first couple weeks, um, I have extra packets. I might go in and send, um, send them a packet and ask them, Hey, you know, do you want to purchase a packet? I have some extra packets here for five bucks, um, and see if they may want to do that. But this is just a really simple way to put your people in here. I believe there's a way to link them to, your um, Facebook and stuff. I know you can put, um, like you can call and stuff, attach. I don't know how to do any of that stuff. I keep it simple. So I'm gonna show you guys just what my, this was my, um, from my weight loss interest post. So these are people that um, I have, have had interest, I've messaged them, I've sent them the link, I followed up, I've enrolled, um, and I'm still working through these follow-ups. So I need to go back in and, and do more, but I've just kept it super, super simple here um, and kept, you know, that's a great way to keep track of people so that way you're not um, all over the place. So any questions, guys, um, please let me know. I hope that helps. You guys have a great afternoon.